Hey, welcome back to ZK Master Tech. Today, we're gonna do a recovery video. We got an S680 that is stranded out in the field. Um, the hydro is bad in this combine, the hydrostatic pump and the pro drive system. Um, it's basically locked up, so we can't run the engine. So what that means is we're not gonna have hydraulics or steering. So this thing's got a corn head on it. It's raised up in the air. So we're gonna have to lower the corn head and the load auger swung out. So we're gonna have to figure out how we're gonna get that swung back. And then we're gonna use a, an 1895R tractor to pull it. And we're gonna take a set of steering hoses that we're gonna hook into the SCBs of the tractor. And we're gonna hook that into the steering cylinder of the combine so we can pull and steer this combine at the same time. We gotta get it out of this field and onto this road and pulled onto a semi-trailer. So, and this field is rough. It's a bombing 29 degrees. It's a little frosty out, but I think we can get her done today. up a power probe so we can try to swing this auger back hopefully releasing the pressure will allow it to go back all right let's see what this does Let me turn the sound off coming out.
different angle at it. Hey, Cody. So we got the auger swung back and I got the safety pin put in so it can't go nowhere. Now we're gonna try to get this feeder house down. I'm gonna try to manually lower it down on blocks. It's got stompers, so we need to make sure we get the corn head off the ground high enough where we get the feeder house out of the, the corn head. Yep, I am. All right, we're gonna give power to this header lowering valve. All right, so we got the, the feeder house down far enough to where the, the hooks are undone. So now we're getting steering hoses put on the back. Those fit, Don? Yeah. Tied into the steering cylinder. So we got our steering hoses plugged in. I'm gonna use the SCV of this tractor to turn these wheels. Didn't have enough pump. Alright. I'm gonna undo the couplers so this thing will roll.
got it loaded on the trailer successfully. We got it chained down. Now we just gotta pick the trailer up with the semi and we're southbound and down. So I hope you guys like to watch this recovery video. Um, it's not something we do a whole lot, but every once in a while we gotta pull one of these dead machines out of the field and that's how we do it right there. Now we're gonna have to escort this rig back. We're gonna have to check all the the turns and make sure we think we can get this low boy around the corner without bottoming out so we're going to drive in front of them and scout the route all right well we made it home we got the trailer dropped now we just gotta hook back up to another tractor and pull this thing off the trailer and figure out what we're going to do with it and where we're going to put it in the shop hey thanks for watching